Jared, Liz, and I, we came together in light of just our nation's awakening to the tragedies and the injustice, um, to the fact that black men and women are dying at the hands of police brutality. So what we wanted to do, we have movements happening in every major city across America. We wanted to make a statement and on behalf of our community and bring in our community to let others know that East Point is a, is a space where we care about black lives too. This here is just step one of many steps that we need to take in order to truly see justice. Um, thank you again for everybody who came. My name is Lacey Pierre. One of our goals in organizing was just to show the fact that um, East Point, like most cities, we're not immune to the inequalities that are faced in this country. And we wanted to demonstrate that East Point and its residents are also committed to driving equity. I am the mother of Jamarian Robinson, and I am so, I'm so happy right now in this moment that East Point came out to show love, you know, to me and my family, you know, in support of Jamarian Robinson. No justice! No, no peace! No justice! No peace! I can't hear you! No justice! No peace! No justice! What we want to do is really show the point that this is a continuing conversation. It's not just a one and done for us either. So this is an opportunity for us to not only shed light on injustice, um, but to serve as a catalyst for us as a community to come together and to drive equitable change. The last couple of weeks I've been really, I've been kind of sad, you know, angry, really angry. But today I've, I've received a lot of love and I am re receiving it. And so I am so thankful and grateful. So thank you, Eastport. I love you. No justice!